everyone. In this video we'll set up the Pyral feed service as an instance on render.com. As preparation steps we need to bring the Docker image to a compatible container registry such as the GitHub registry. To do that, log into the Pyral container registry, pull the image, then give it a new tag pointing to the compatible container registry. Finally, log into the compatible container registry and publish the image there. The image must remain private. Afterwards, you can create a new web service in your render.com project. Select the existing image option for the service's source code. Enter the full image tag and select the corresponding credentials. You might need to create them first. Fill out the form using a region that is close to your customers, as well as a good name and adequate service plan. For our demo as well as some dev purposes the free tier is good enough. We don't configure the service yet. Press deploy to get it up and running. We expect some failures in the logs, but the service itself should start. In the browser the configurator should show up. Now it's time to finish the configuration. For the data storage such as the database and files we'll reuse a managed data service from another cloud provider. Otherwise, fill out the environment variables using the .env option. Finally, hit save and deploy to store the new settings and restart the service. Now it's time to see if the service is up and running. If everything looks fine we can create a new feed to test it. On the dashboard view click on create new feed and enter some details. Hit the review and create button followed by the create button to finish adding the new feed. Congratulations, you've just set up the Pyral feed service running on render.com.